I'm gonna do something cool with the cricket. So BAM! Hey, it's Kim! And Garrett! Do you like do-it-yourself projects? If you do, go ahead and give us a like, share, and subscribe. And we have a new video each week. This week, we found this make a bowl without a lathe challenge from Rag and Bone Brown. I'll put his link down below. There's a bunch in the playlist. First thing I thought was like, ooh, I get to have fire and burn the bowl out. And then I saw a bunch of people burning bowls out. So then I was like, I'm gonna do something cool with the cricket. So BAM! I didn't do this one. <laughs> that one's too hard. <laughs> so, we had a couple of prototypes. We started off small, making some pentagons. Then we tried a bigger one, and we're like, okay, it works. So now we're gonna make another one. Um, but this time we're gonna put holes in it and pin it together with some, with some copper wire. The Cricut is like a tiny CNC machine. Yeah. It's like a tiny CNC machine. So you gotta use tiny wood. So we used balsa wood. So we used our Cricut design space to cut our pentagons. It was pretty simple. I just chose shapes, pentagon, pulled it to seven and a half inches because the balsa wood comes in eight inch strips. Next step is to add painter's tape and drill holes to put the copper wire through. All right, since the wood is so soft, I'm gonna try to pin them all together and, and drill all through all of them at once. All right, so we did four holes down each side and across the bottom. And the one that we're using for the bottom, we put four holes on every side. We're gonna take the tape off and then we're gonna go paint them and then we'll be back. All of our pieces are back from paint. Ooh, pick a card, any card. Mm, lucky pink and gray. Is this your card? All right, now we're just gonna tie them all together with some copper wire. We're gonna do X's up the sides, but- uh, We're gonna see how that goes. Yeah, that's we our plan. That's yes, the plan. We haven't tried it yet. Let's pin them together. Yes. Sew them if you got them. So we just cut a piece, I bent it like a U, I stuck them through, I bent them over so they overlap, and then I snipped them where they crossed. Yeah, so there's the inside and the outside. There's our crown so far. There's our bowl so far. Yeah, totally. Look at that. I love it. So I'm no, king want. of the bowls. Oh, it looks way better on you. So <laughs> we win. <laughs> all right, what we're doing is we, we're just putting little ringlets all around the bottom to hold it. There's our bowl. There's the inside and the bottom. Oh. All right. You ready for the montage? <laughs> We're gonna do it right here. Thanks for watching. That was our submission to the Rag and Bone Brown Bowl Without a Lathe Challenge. If you guys like DIY, you liked our project this week, we do one every week. So go ahead and give us a like and subscribe, and we'll see you guys next week. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks, Rag and Bone Brown. <laughs>